still mind my shirt. You know what? I'm about to change it. Because you know what that is? Freaking mustard. Mustard that fell off of my sandwich that I had for breakfast a few hours ago. But I've been sitting playing. I've been gaming a little bit this morning. So, yeah, let me change my shirt. All right, your girl changed her shirt. But, uh, yeah, I'm about to just go and start, um, start dinner. Oh, just take from my sister. Because I've been having this pain in my right boob, but it kind of feels like a muscle spasm. So, um, yeah, it kind of feels like a muscle spasm. But I don't want to take a muscle relaxer yet because it's going to put me to sleep. Ooh, it's cold out here. That's because I had on a heater across the hall. But, yeah. So, oh, sorry, y'all. That's my phone. But, yeah, the muscle relaxer will put me right to sleep. So, I want to make this chili first and stuff before I take it. That's what my sister's probably telling me. She's probably telling me to take it. <sighs> but, yeah, so probably take it after I cook. Like I said, I'm gonna make some chili. Can't have the beans, so I'm pretty upset about that. Oh, but your girl needs to grab my slow cooker because I'm gonna put it in the slow cooker after I brown the ground turkey. I'm gonna brown it and then, um, Make the chili and then, uh, yeah, I'll probably take that and it probably make me take a nap. I'll probably set an alarm so that way I only sleep for like an hour. Um, because your girl don't want to sleep all day. So, <gasps> well, um, so that's what I'll probably do. Not much plan for the day. Probably watch some football with the hubby and, um, just chill. My garlic infused oil. I should put some more garlic in here though. I feel like it might need it. Let me see. Well, oh, I guess I could smell the garlic in there because I only put like three cloves because this wasn't a big jar, but you can, you can smell it. So maybe I'll just wait, see how it how it tastes first, and then maybe add some more. So, but let your girl make this um, chili. <laughs> oh, the chili is just about done. letting it cook down still got about almost five minutes left to cook smells so good <sighs> but um your girl forgot four things at the grocery store yesterday so i might just go grab those before i take this muscle relaxer because once i take that i'm gonna go i'm gonna fall asleep um for my stomach, I needed some yogurt, but I, I was trying to find non-dairy yogurt. So that, and then some um, gluten-free crackers for this chili. I ain't got no crackers. Um, so I'm, I will need to find some gluten-free crackers for this chili, and then um, grab Mark some roast beef from the deli. But yeah, your girl needs some stuff because next weekend stuff is going to be closed or closing early because of christmas so i just wanted to make sure i had everything you know oh, this is going to be my guilty pleasure on christmas i'm gonna make some gingerbread cookies i have um gingerbread men cookie cutters on the way they're being they're going to be delivered i think wednesday 
so I'm, that's gonna be my dessert for Christmas instead of making like a pie or a cake or whatever I'm gonna make gingerbread cookies um, because there's stuff in here the only thing I'm not supposed to have is the wheat flour but I don't plan on sitting here and just eating these cookies like that I'll probably have like one or two maybe take some to my sister or my daughter um, because this is quite a big pack but your girl loves gingerbread cookies so I'm gonna do those and I got my ham and I'm just gonna make like some vegetables like some green beans and stuff I'm not going overboard because I went overboard for Thanksgiving and I definitely was feeling it after because I was eating a lot of stuff I wasn't supposed to eat so I'm actually making the foods that I can eat but the dessert is gonna be the only thing that isn't on my thing of list of stuff to eat but I'm just gonna have very limited quantity um, but you know I can have it depending on how my body reacts to it if it gives me inflammation if it gives me bloating pain then I'm not gonna have it but excuse me man your girl cannot wait for this um, chili to be done cuz I had a sandwich this morning but it was like a piece of a sandwich it was probably like that thin like it wasn't big well, look at this girl what you want what you want you want a carrot look you want a carrot oh I gotta do something with the mushrooms too you want this let me get my girl a carrot Focus, camera, focus. There we go. This girl loves fruits and vegetables. Like, she will eat this stuff before she will eat her treats. She loves carrots. Huh. I'm only gonna give her two. They're the baby carrots, anyway. I'm glad carrots are on the list of stuff I can have. Because your girl can't eat a lot of vegetables. And if I do, I have to have very limited amounts. Like broccoli. I can have very limited amounts of broccoli. So, one of these days I'm going to make some beef and broccoli. Since it's not in my diet all the time. To make like an Asian stir fry with some shrimp and mushrooms and stuff so I might do that this week which I'm very excited about because I love me some Asian food my bestie growing up like Linda she's from Vegas she I've been around their family my almost my entire life and I think that's where my love of Asian food came in huh. that's my chili timer y'all Go get my cracker so I can um eat because your girl is hungry. I ate at about eight o'clock this morning, so it is lunchtime. Uh, oh, low five map diet definitely helps my stomach get off because the days that I don't steer like off from my diet, I feel great, like my stomach feels great. I know it's TMI, but I go to the bathroom regularly. You know, for people who deal with IBS know what I'm talking about. Um, and it definitely helps. So, but I'm about to get dressed so I can run to the stove and get this stuff that I need. I don't know. Oh, there we go. But yeah, I'm just gonna get dressed so I can go and um, get this stuff so I can eat lunch. And 
I meant to pull out my camera, but it's so busy in the grocery store, but Santa and Mrs. Claus were there. They were walking around, saying hi to everybody. And I love their attire. Um, I think it's so cool that they come to the grocery store. And you could see parents and grandparents on FaceTime showing their kids Santa and Mrs. Claus and they're talking to them, you know, on FaceTime and stuff and it's really cool. <sighs> but now I'm on my way home. I got way more stuff than I expected. Um, I got stuff for my list but when I went into those areas, I was like, oh, I forgot to grab this and then, oh, I forgot to grab this and so, um, yeah, so I ended up getting more than what I wanted to grab. But hey, I have it, then I don't gotta go out later and get it. Because I didn't plan on coming to the store today. Because I went yesterday. <sighs> oh my gosh, why are people driving so slow? It's literally 30 miles per hour, and this person's doing like 15. like 21 degrees but with the wind chill it feels like eight so your girl's trying to get in the house yeah oh hey guys it's some hours later your girl just had some oysters they were bomb as hell my first time personally making them i eat them but i just never made them myself that shit was so I steamed them. I have a steamer pot and I steamed them for about 12 minutes and they came out perfect. I had put some lemon juice, some thyme, um, a little bit of ginger into the water and then I steamed them. And then after they came out, I had some melted butter, some parsley, put a little splash of lemon juice in there and put it over the oysters and I sipped it with the oysters. They had these on sale and your girl had six of them and they were so good. I just hate that oysters. I hate that seafood is so expensive. Um, it's just ridiculous, <laughs> like ridiculously expensive. So I was glad that they were on sale because then I was able to get them because they were on sale. But I'm just gonna jump, dump out the remnants of the butter and throw them in a separate bag because seafood does stink up the garbage. So just gonna dispose of that and then chill watch um the 1883 series um it's a series that's off of the yellowstone series such good series i love yellowstone so i'm gonna um watch 1883 because 1923 just came out today and that's another series off of those um so i'm gonna watch those but just wanted to hop on say thanks so much for watching make sure you hit that thumbs up button um and comment down below if you guys want to see anything Tomorrow I have uh, three doctor's appointments in the same day. I have um, a follow-up for the MRI I got of my neck. That's tomorrow morning. And then I have the CT scan of my nose. And then after that is the follow-up for the t CT scan to go over that to see when I can um, schedule my surgery. So, yeah. So, it's going to be a busy day tomorrow. But I will definitely keep y'all posted. Y'all have a good night.